Christmas. Today, I'm making a Christmas dish for a quiet family luncheon. It's not elaborate and so is ideal for the busy festive season when you really need to be making other things. For this recipe, you will need sherry, raisin wine, red currant jelly, sugar, Swiss roll, custard, and almond macaroons. This really is like a trifle. It has cake and biscuits, wine sauce, jelly, custard, and decoration. This one has a Swiss roll, so I'm going to slice it up and then layer it in my serving dish. Swiss rolls really are quite new. I don't remember hearing about them when I was younger, but in the last few years, more and more confectioners have been selling them. I do think they are a little bit middle class. All show and not much to them, but they are very popular and they do look nice, which is why I'm using one for this dish. I didn't buy this one. I made it. But if you're on your own or you don't have much help, I suppose it would be all right, so long as you could trust your confectioner not to use cheap jam or too much baking powder. Now I'm going to put my macaroons on top of the cake. Now for the wine sauce. I'm going to soak my Swiss roll and macaroons in a wine sauce. Christmas isn't a time for abstinence, so I'm going to add some sherry. Some raisin wine, which is like a sweet dessert wine. And a little sugar. I'm now going to heat this through while the sugar melts and then bring it to the boil. I'm now going to let my cake soak up the sauce. I might go and write some Christmas cards while I'm waiting. Now that my cake is moist, I'm going to add the custard. It's a simple custard that I thickened with corn flour. This really is like a trifle, although my proper trifle is far more exciting. Luncheon and supper dishes are often much plainer, as the meals themselves are less formal. Often it's just the family, no guests, well, unless they're staying. In fact, luncheon is often just the ladies, as Lord Braybrook is in Cambridge or in town, and Mr Strutt, when he's staying, is often at business with his cooperative society. Mr Lincoln, the butler, says that Mr Strutt hopes to make enough money that he'll retire soon. He's only 30. Now all is left is to decorate with a little angelica and candied flowers.
we are, a Christmas dish. I hope you have a good festive season.